Back, we have some Dolphins drama to tell you about tonight. The team's owner is being openly criticized by one of his players. And this all about showing support for President Trump. Local 10 News reporter Nikki Mohan is live in Miami Gardens with the story. Nikki. Nicole and Louis Hard Rock Stadium rocking this evening with soccer fans for the Barcelona Napoli game. Tomorrow it'll be the Finns' turn against Atlanta. And while the front office and the players would like to be talking about that matchup, they're probably going to be talking a lot about Stills versus Stephen Ross. Miami Dolphins receiver Kenny Stills calling out team owner Stephen Ross for hosting a fundraiser for President Donald Trump at his New York home later this week. Stills tweeting, you can't have a nonprofit with this mission statement, then open your doors to Trump. If there's any place where there's equality. He then put a link to Ross's nonprofit Rise's mission Rise statement, which reads, We are a national nonprofit that educates and empowers the sports community to eliminate racial discrimination, champion social justice, and improve race relations. President Donald Trump is criticized by some for polarizing rhetoric. Billionaire Stephen Ross has been an acquaintance of President Trump for many years before he was in office. Both are big time New York developers. We're dedicated to promoting understanding. RISE, his nonprofit, is an acronym for Ross Initiative in Sports Equality. Kenny Stills has been an active participant in RISE's mission. The 27-year-old has been one of the most vocal players in the NFL in recent years, promoting social causes and raising awareness about police brutality and justice reform. He continues to protest social inequality by kneeling during the pregame playing of the national anthem or by sometimes remaining in the tunnel before coming out on the field. Stills has also aligned himself with former 49ers quarterback Colin Kaepernick, who has been at the forefront of protesting social injustice on the NFL stage. We reached out to the Dolphins for comment today. We haven't heard back from them just yet. The uh, camp was closed today. No practice because of tomorrow's preseason's game. We'll catch up with them tomorrow before the game, and we'll let you know more about this. For now, live in Miami Gardens at Hard Rock Stadium, Nikki Mohan, Local 10 News.